This story did not begin in the wealthiest of wombs, or streams flowing with liquid gold and silver spoons dipped into stews garnished with privilege. In this story, the king was once a peasant, a humble son to parents of humble mints, a firm hand on the farm, shepherds of rolling herds fetching feed for the farmished of the flock. There was no power in his homestead, but everyone agreed. His heart shone with the radiance of a thousand fireflies, regardless of how dark the night. These were different times, grassroot times. Kojoli was the place he first learned to dream, under the soft glow of crackling firewood flame, to ask, what miracle can these proper hands grow? And to pray the prayer of a seed in dirt. But dirt is a fertile ground for the germination of being. The story, from the wind-swept northeastern landscapes in all their glorious barrenness, with the gates of his father's house, shot against the penetration of Western education, it seemed like the future would be full of doors no son of Garba would be able to unlock. But destiny is a dogged shadow, chasing and chasing until it caught him in Jada. God bless Kau Ali, who had learned to believe even in those grassroot times grazed by doubt, he would register the little dreamer in a school and did not scorn his baby steps as if to say, yes, even the Iroko was once a tender seedling, learning to survive the rage of seasons. So dream, let the stars guide you. This story is about the path the dreamer towed through toil and tremor, tempest and tide, eating failure like yams. Some of them were hard to swallow, but it takes a man thirsty for triumph, to keep watering his spirit when losses come encroaching like desert sands. Orphaned at 11, mother's heart gave up when the star of a chap began to glisten. He faced the world with a wrestled smile. Someone once said, grace is God's gift to you, but discipline is the gift you give yourself. Tito your debt though. This is Atiku, and Lord knows it takes a man, yearning for mastery to refuse to open the door when the urge to give up comes knocking. This is Atiku, giving back generously to the very land that turned its back on him. Mounted castles, where only shacks once stood, this is Atiku, who does not just say, education is the key, but has forayed into the fairy foreigners to forge many keys for our children. The man who has stood the test of age and times, who has ascended realms only few have dreamt, this is Atiku, battled the pressures of the Echolon to return to us as the diamond in the sky, who has scattered his seeds of unity in a land fragmented by shallow loyalties. Atiku, the man who has built empathy out of resentment, resilience out of defeat and grace out of grass, this is Atiku, Wazirin Adamawa, Namiju Barkono, Mai Akuya Yai Tafi and Derema Bale Mai Kura, I wajan so can do kiba, wajan so can jirgi baniba. Kumakoda kura baya chizu, I baza a hada to the ragoba. Kumaman sanchiwa kowana alani a made damo, I name you go nani. This man, willing to speak our problems into the light and articulate solutions for the good of all. Atiku. The man for whom our collective struggle is but a deja vu and trust the man who has done it once to do it again. For out of Jada, a bud of hope has risen like a prophecy and this time it will not wither in vain by the light of his heart and the willingness of the people as active stakeholders in the business of actualizing the greater tomorrow we all dream. Nigeria, the universe is calling. It is our time to answer.